Alberta has some of the most dynamic landscapes on earth. As dedicated hikers, mountain bikers, hunters, trappers, fishes, or fishers, campers, and climbers, we Albertans understand the importance of preserving our wild areas and the importance of having tourism and recreation areas that are world class, that grow our economy and create good jobs. For generations, the leaders who have come before us have done a lot to protect our land. In the 1970s, when there was increased pressure on Banff, Premier Peter Lougheed created Kananaskis Country. He did that by creating a space that inspires us to truly appreciate the beauty on our doorsteps. He did that by listening to many, many different people, different groups, and making a place for everyone. So now, K Country is a region that holds great meaning and lasting memories for so many Albertans and so many visitors from around the world. Today, just like in the 1970s, Alberta is seeing new pressure on our parks. Over a million people have moved to Alberta in the last decade. And in true Alberta spirit, people love to get outdoors. One of the places people are going to more and more is Bighorn Country. For those not familiar with this area, Bighorn Country includes all public lands from the boundary of Banff National Park eastward towards Drayton Valley. There are rare and at-risk species such as grizzly bears, harlequin ducks, and rainbow and bull trout. Bighorn Country is also a source of clean drinking water for over a million people. So just like Premier Law he did with K Country, today we are seizing the opportunity to create something special. That something special is the Bighorn Country. Today we are announcing that we are putting a plan on the table to formally establish Bighorn Country. Like K Country, this plan includes parks, provincial recreation zones, campgrounds, and public land use zones. And it includes lots of fun things to do. Snowmobiling, off-highway vehicle usage, uh, usage, Nordic skiing, some of the best hiking in Canada, and great hunting and fishing. Whether it's hiking, backpacking, scrambling, mountaineering, rock climbing, ice climbing, or ski touring, the Alpine Club of Canada welcomes and encourages all people to share in our passion for the outdoors. That's part of what makes today so exciting, and I'm ecstatic. Banff, Jasper, Kananaskis, all these areas offer amazing experiences for Albertans and visitors for near and far, but the Bighorn region holds a special place in the hearts of our members. With stunning vistas and amazing summer and winter climbing areas like Crescent Falls and the White Goat Mountains, the Bighorn truly is a treasure. Preserving the Bighorn country is a true gift to outdoor explorers who share a common love for the Rocky Mountains.